Hello, hello. Uh, Punk Rockin' here again to show you how to change um, different themes on your sexy retro pie. So that mo can even look sexier, if uh, that's even possible. I mean, I find it already attractive, but, you know, I won't complain. Uh, but uh, this video, I'm going to show you how to change themes um, that are already built into the retro pie. Um, really quick, uh, you're going to need your keyboard this time, a controller, and your RetroPie set up and updated uh, to do this. If you haven't done that yet and you don't know how, check out my other video on how to set up a RetroPie and get one ROM going and then uh, come back here. Um, but without further ado, I'll uh, hop over on the TV and I will show you what is up. All right, here we are uh, heading over to the TV and uh let's get going on this all right um so first thing we are going to want to do is go to retro pie um, i'm using my controller so i just went there and hit a but uh, make sure you have your keyboard on there because you're going to need it here in a sec and we're going to want to go down to uh es themes here and we're going to uh, uh hit a on that hit the wrong button and uh, so now we are here and the first thing we are going to want to do is download theme gallery uh, so that's number one go ahead and hit OK on that and it's going to do this little thing down here it shouldn't take long um, <clears throat> you really don't have to do this but it makes everything a lot easier I mean if you notice all them there uh all all the options those are the actual themes some are installed some are not installed um it might be different on yours but we're basically putting in a, th a gallery so we can browse through them um we can remove it later if we want to but uh this is the first thing we're gonna do and uh, it should be almost done here and there it is so now i'm gonna go ahead and update the theme gallery uh so that way it's going to pull in there it's i think it's already updated but just go ahead and do that step anyway just to make sure and then now uh, we're going to go ahead and go back in there and we're going to view theme gallery that's the first option all right so this is going to go ahead and automatically go through the theme gallery here uh, if you just let it go it's going to show you the different uh what the different sections look like um, if you want to go ahead and skip around, uh, skip forward, you can hit the B or A button on your uh, controller, and that'll jump around here. And they got a whole bunch of different ones that are already included in here. Uh, they show the games different ways. Um, cool stuff like that. Definitely make your uh, Atari a little cooler. Um but yeah, just keep going through, and then once you find one you like, uh, you want to go ahead and look in the bottom left corner of the screen there, and see how this one says Turtle Pie Game List. Uh, this one says Simpler Dash Turtle. Uh, make note of that in the bottom left, and we'll go ahead and do, let's say, Simple Dash Dark will do. Um so once you figure that out go ahead and hit the uh the escape on your uh, keyboard there um you need to hit escape no other button works for on the controller i've tried a whole bunch of other ones so that's really all you need the keyboard for but we'll go ahead and go down to what is it simple dash dark so i already have it installed but um yours may or may not be um sometimes they are sometimes they're not but i'm just gonna go ahead and install turtle pie just for the hell of it um and it'll go through it'll only take a second and then yeah that's really much uh it about that just go ahead and hit uh cancel all right now that we're all the way back here we're gonna go ahead and hit the uh start button and i'm gonna go down to ui settings and then I'm going to go all the way down to theme set and I'm going to hit a on there and here here's the one that came with it and here's what we installed so I'm going to hit a on that I'm going to hit back 
And there's our theme. Um, it's really as simple as that. And um, so that's what that one looks like. So uh, that's pretty much uh, it on this. Uh, pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Um, it will definitely add some pizzazz or whatever you want to call it uh, to your retro pie. Me personally, um, I haven't found a need to make my own theme yet because a lot of these are pretty damn cool in my opinion. But um, there is knowledge out there on how to do it and I will have a video uh, covering more on this uh, in the near future. But uh, that's it for this video on how to change themes for your retro pie. Um, check out my other videos for more knowledge on the pies of retro. But uh, again, thanks for watching and uh, have a good one.